hit that subscribe button, and then click on the bell to never miss a video. Also, if you guys want to get some It's Richie W merch, links down in the description. In this world, apocalypse has fallen. War, disease, and decimation led to a plague that cannot be defeated. A plague of zombies, the dead, risen from the afterlife. While the military attempts to grasp tightly to the ways of the past, others have begun to live by their own means in this new forsaken world. The remaining humans must unite together to fight off the infectious dead, and worse, the living. Welcome to Origin C. Hey, Doc? Mm. Hey, oh. Doc. Detective? Where are you? Up here. Detective? Up, up here? Walk outside a little bit. I, I am outside. Oh, you're up there. Hi. Yeah, I might have walked into your garage. Sorry. Eh, it's fine. It's whatever. Everyone does it. Why are you on the roof? Let's take a smoke break. Right, of course, of course. But that I see you out. haven't, uh, you haven't cleaned this up. Eh, it's not really worth cleaning. Ugh, but anyway. So, uh, you, you wanted me to come? Yes, I wanted to look into some things with you, since now I have an actual test subject for this stuff. I figured it'd be a good idea to actually put you to use to try and figure right. out some things. Yeah, sure, sure. Did you have a place or thing in mind? You have a notebook. Okay. Uh, well, the middle of the street works. Well, maybe, yeah, probably, probably a few of these might need to be done in the street. Um. Okay. I didn't yeah, I think yeah, we'll, crazy. Just, we'll just do it in the street. That's fine. Sure. Whatever sure. works. As long as there's nothing around. I don't think anyone's okay, going to be driving around. To be honest. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. So, I have some tests here that right. I have written down for you to try out. Um, most of these should be fine. Some of these might be a little interesting. I'm, I'm probably going to have to scratch out the flammable one. Ah, uh, the flammable you know. one. Yeah, so apparently zombies are very flammable. I'm assuming because their flesh is deteriorated. Uh, yeah, people do light on fire and burn. And that is probably not good for me too. I don't think you can aim fire away from my head. Mm. So I'll uh, I'll cross that one out for now. I have not really I'll have to test that on somebody that else. Yeah, I've been working on getting some incendiary rounds set up so I can actually test this. Yeah, I also can't see burning zombies alive as the cure. Eh, it's just a test, nothing more. So uh, okay. what else you got? So. One test we have, it's going to sound weird, but citrus. For some reason, zombies don't like citrus, or at least that's uh, what I've heard. I mean, at least from my experience, zombies don't like human food in general. So how, does this, how do you feel about that orange? I mean, it's an orange. Um, does it make you feel weird? <laughs> okay, well, you don't like it. Ugh. Yep, just like 
pretty much all human food horrible. Well, except uh, except hot sauce. Did it, did it scent sauce is good. make you feel weird at all? Did it did it make you uncomfortable? Did it make you not want to be near it? Anything like that? I mean, it's, no, it just tastes horrible. Hmm. Maybe I'll have to test that on another zombie. Maybe half zombies don't have to worry about that since they're half human. Yeah, maybe. Okay, all right, put that down as a, as a no for now. But we'll look into that at another point. Okay, so next is pain tolerance. I'm not really so sure how much pain you can take without it actually affecting you. Um, quite a bit, I think. Quite a bit? I've been shot. I've been crushed up against walls. Mm. So I, th I think I can take as long as it's not the head. Okay. You, you're going to shoot me? Uh, well, I'll shoot you in the arm. Oh, okay. As long uh, as that's okay with you. Just don't miss. I'll try not to. All right. Okay. Three, two, one, go. <sighs> yep. <laughs> Shot me in the arm, all right. It's like nothing happened. Yeah, it's almost like being pinched. Hmm. That's kind of the feeling of being shot anywhere. It's like being pinched pretty hard in that spot. And it lasts. And your arm still second. works completely fine. It's still mobile. You can still move it around like nothing happened. Yep. <laughs> Complete motions. All right. Well, pain tolerance is definitely a good to go. <sighs> yep. You can move it all around. Okay. So next, uh, we'll do the blood sample last. That's easy enough. Where did you Let's work on these poisons. Poison. Oh, the notes? I don't even know if you know this person. Do you know the, uh, ugh, I don't remember his name. He was a little weird. Uh, he looks like a high schooler or something like that. Uh, the high schoolers that I've seen, Colin or uh, Jonathan, I think his name was. Did he, does his coat clothes look a little messed up? A little? Yeah. Did he act a little strange? Did he call things butterflies and what's not? Oh, uh, yep, that's the one. Yeah, he was uh -huh. a real crazy kid, that's for sure. I think he'd been alone too long. Mm. Another one lost to the storm. But anyways, I helped him out and he gave me his book of experiments that he'd been doing. He's been experimenting on zombies, so all of those labs uh. were his? That kid? Uh. I don't know. I haven't been there. I wouldn't know. Didn't really want to get involved. I was I investigating a, a school where I met him and he had like cells. Mm. It was shady. I didn't think they were his, but I guess that adds everything up. So you were, yeah. you were saying something about poison. Yes. So I got this poison bottle. Shouldn't affect me and it shouldn't affect you. We should hopefully um, be fine. I doubt yeah. that you'll poison will kill you. I have not been poisoned, so. <laughs> All right, well, this will be fun. Okay. Obviously, I'm wearing a mask, so this ain't going to bother me. Oh, OK, I guess go for it. Yeah. Also, don't tell the colonel I took this. Oh, he is not in my good books. Don't All right, you perfect. Worry. Glad we're on the same one about that same book. Right. He did try to poison test in three, two, one. All right, now we just gotta wait for that sucker to pop. There oh we go. Boy. <clears throat> ah, that's like very odd smell. Apple pie in here. Apple pie. <laughs> <clears throat> the poison filters very Hello. strangely through this mask. <sighs> so, anything? Do you feel weird? Weaker? I mean, no, not really. Okay, well that's good at least. It's no, no effect. I just see green. All right. Well, then that is a good thing. So we know that you're poison resistant. You probably want your grenade. Empty bag. Eh, that's okay. I'm probably going to bury that somewhere anyways. <sighs> okay. Okay. So <clears throat> poison. poison, not the answer. Poison does not work against them. Interesting. I also don't know if I spelled that right. That's okay. <sighs> so citrus is a no. Flammable, I'll have to test on my own time. Pain tolerance is incredibly high, which is very interesting. Yeah, and I guess that's the zombie side. Go. Uh, 
Well, I'm glad that I've tested these things out, but they don't really help me with a cure. I just figured I'd look into them since we had an actual subject. Yeah. So <sighs> there couldn't be more help. I'm not really sure what else really could. Unless you had some sort of concoction. It's like... A... No, nothing like that. Just don't know how you <sighs> like, reverse engineer something like this. Just everything with my notes is just always just this one thing missing. And I don't know what it is. Maybe if I take a blood sample from you or something, but that'll help. I mean, go for it. I... All right, well, come downstairs. I need to get those. Okay. I mean, you also you have the you have the orange that has some DNA, saliva, and whatnot on it. Maybe that'll be useful. That's true. I could possibly use that, but I'd rather have a blood sample too. I've got a blood sample of almost everyone here, so I might as well hold on to them. Yeah, I mean, I could see a blood sample being of more use than most other things. Oh boy. Okay. That's all right. I don't think I'll leave Look, the fields. If, if you can take a bullet, you could take a syringe. <laughs> yeah, I just, I never used to like needles. All right, there we oh. go. See? Okay. Nothing at all. Yeah, I think uh. that's more of a mental thing than a pain thing. All right. So, I guess I'll look at this blood sample when I have a chance. For now, I've got everything I think I need. I mean, yeah, if that's uh, everything, I was planning on heading outside the walls today, so. Oh. Got some okay. things I gotta do on my own. Mm. Hopefully that goes well. Thanks. Uh, so yeah, uh, let me know if that helps or comes up with anything. Keep me, keep me in the know. Sure thing. I mean, I have to go make cookie or pills now before she arrives sometime soon. And I still need yeah. to figure out Michael's situation. Ah, yeah. Have fun with that. And, uh... I'll try. I'll see you soon. Alright, I mean, good luck out there. Stay safe. Hey, Zoe. Let's do this. Really? I can finally move out of this fridge. You can. We're gonna go to my old place and visit a friend. Get you looking human again. And then we'll bring you into safe haven the right way. I couldn't be more ready. Just know, this place isn't as safe as it seems. So stay close, okay? I don't want anything happening to you. I will, but come on, you know me. I can look out for myself. I know, you're not an easy target. But this apocalypse has really brought out the crazies. Then we'll have to protect each other from them. You're on. Let's go. We want to get back before nightfall. Zoe, run! Richie! Oh, oh no. I... Run. I... Okay. Freak. Huh? Wait. Hey! Get back here! What the? How? How is it so fast? Uh, uh, 
Zoe? Oh, please be here. Please be here. I want that... That thing catch you. Oh. My old house. Zoe? 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 Zoe! No, 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 no. Zoe, Zoe, are, we, are you in here? Maybe she's at the back. Zoe? Z Zoe? Anywhere? Z Zoe? Wait. The basement. Zoe! Zoe! Wait, what's this? I have her. I have her, and you want her back. If you want her, come to the wood construction site on the outskirts of town. And come alone. Kill this guy, whoever you are messing with me. You're dead. You lay a hand on her and you're dead! Okay, the wood construction site. Let's get some time. I better get running. Zoe! Zoe, who did this? Richie, it's a trap. <laughs> so you finally arrived? Who are you? What do you want? Oh, I want to play a little game. It's called Guess Who. You're a psychopath, that's who. Show yourself. <laughs> That's not a rule of the game. Answer her question correctly, and so shall I. I'm not telling you anything. Oh, yes. I forgot the threatening part. Answer the questions, or the girl dies. Don't do anything for him, Richie. <sighs> Fine. What are your questions? How many have zombies? Like you are there. Um, three. Wrong. Wait, no, four. But how could you even know that? I know everything. And what's the point of the game? Just a bit of fun before the grand finale. Whatever you're gonna do, do it to me. Let her go. No, Richie. Just leave me. You can save yourself. Quiet, girl! <gasps> We're the best park, and you're in no position to meet the mess detective. Fine. I'll do whatever you ask. Just let her go. Beg. <laughs> beg for her life? <laughs> Get on your knees and beg. Okay. Please. I'm begging you. Let her go. She's not what you want. You want me for whatever reason. And I'm, I'm sorry. Just please let her go. Hmm. No. No. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> I, I love you. I'm so sorry. <laughs> ah. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you, you son of a bitch! I'm gonna murder the living fuck out of you! Oh, yeah. <laughs> if you survive this. <laughs> I'm sorry! 
Living through the terrors, either blessed to you. 